Assalamu alaikum, it's your boy Harun Qureshi in the house. Yeah! We are here for another video, another banger as always. What we're going to be doing is something very exciting for you today. We're going to be showing you how to find profitable products that are going to make you a lot of money. Money! All right, do you want to make money is the question, okay? Are you serious about this, right? Because there's either two ways you're making money right now. Number one, you're selling your time for money. You're in a bookwash job, a job that you don't like with a manager who's an idiot, an environment of that is toxic, uh, you're overworked, you're underpaid, you're a slave to a system, you don't know when you're going to wake up or when you can wake up, you can't have a lion, you'll get fired, okay, blah 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 blah. If you're in a job you don't like, now is the time to escape that slavery world, the nine to five slavery, okay? Instead of selling your time for money, what you need to do is you need to sell products for money. You need to be able to sell products profitably and scale that so that now you're able to earn way more than that bookwas nine to five job, okay? And on top of that, you're in a position where you only need to work a few hours a week and you're chilling. You're chilling, maxing, relaxing, cheating some people out and a couple of guys who went up the hood. Blah, blah. Anyway, what happened to, uh, what's his name? Uh, Will Smith after the slap incident. Ha! Ha! I'm sure he would do it right. Uh, 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 okay, where are we doing? Okay, so back into the training. So what we're gonna do now, we're gonna jump in and get into start finding some products. I'm gonna show you exactly how to find profitable products. But before I do, I need you to do something for me, my beautiful viewer of YouTube. Number one, subscribe to this channel because I'm gonna be releasing a few things, a, a, a lot more things onto this channel that you're gonna find super beneficial. And if you're not subscribed, then you're gonna miss out, okay? I'm gonna have to do a will slip slap on you if you don't subscribe. Ah! Anyway, point number two, like this video. And third thing is, write a comment now, now or later, just say thanks or something like that. Let me know what you found of this video. Ask me any questions you want. One other thing is, look, you know other people that are interested in business. They're gonna find this video extremely beneficial. So after this video, have a few people that you're happy to share it with. And by you liking, subscribing, commenting, sharing really helps with my algorithms. And I'm doing this for free for you. So if there's anything you can do for me, it just help me push it out. I'd really appreciate that. One last point is by the end of the video, you might be in a position where you do want my help and my team's help with some more advanced training just to accelerate your success. So in the description uh, area, there's actually going to be a link there where you get access to more training and you'll even be able to book a call with me and my team if you want to work with us, all right? So do check that link out as well and that will allow you to fast track what you're doing if you want some more one-to-one -one support, all right? So that is everything done and dusted. Let's jump in and show you how to make some money. All right, so we're going to jump into the training now where I'm going to show you products and, and how to find good products. But before I do that, I just want you to understand what the goal is here, right? Which is to get you in a position where your business is doing 10K in sales a month ten thousand dollars or pounds a month in sales okay and it's actually not as difficult as you might think because what we're going to do is we're going to sell products at uh prices where you know around about minimum should be 50 pounds okay and we're going to add these products onto our own e-commerce store our own store online that people are going to go to okay and these products are not our products where we have to pay for inventory or manage it we're going to connect <clears throat> we're going to connect our store to uh, other suppliers and when a customer makes a purchase it's the supplier that then sends the product to the customer for us and in that way we don't need to pay for stock nor do we need to um, get ourselves in a position where um, we need to manage uh, fulfillment and sending products to customers. So it's very automated, okay? It's an automated process. So we're going to add a product for at least $50 onto our own store, okay? Now, if you'd, if, if our goal is $10,000, okay, say, okay, and it can be pounds, it can be dollars or whatever currency you're in. Normally, we like to sell in the US, so I'm going to stick with dollars for this example. What we do is we divide that by 50, okay? And that, uh, and that gives us how many units we need to sell to get to that thousand mark how many units we need to sell them in a month and the answer is 200 okay so if we sold um 200 units of a product for 50 dollars okay within a month that will reach us the 10,000 k in sales all right now if we were to even analyze it on a daily level if we get that 200 divided by 28 minimum days there is we get the figure of around seven all right let's say we round it up to 10 okay so essentially what we need to do is we need to find a product that will give us minimum 10 sales a day okay and that will allow us to create a six-figure business that's doing a, <clears throat> around 120k uh, a year in sales okay in revenue now 
margin can be anywhere between 20 to 40 percent let's say it's 30 percent so that means 36 thousand dollars profit a year as a minimum this should be the bare minimum you should be able to achieve with this business okay and alhamdulillah the people that we work with have achieved way way more right so for example here's a sister who <coughs> by the way i've got a sore throat so do bear with me with with any coughing that you might hear okay so <coughs> this 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 girl here she never done business before we taught her the process on how to do it we handheld her throughout the whole process i'm just gonna put a sweet in my mouth so i can um don't cough all right um so she um uh she's never done business before <clears throat> and then you know this is an example of just the fact that this works i made my most set or um my go i made my most orders yesterday 31 orders okay so i'm telling you to make minimum 10 within her first month you know with the product she's got 31 orders 2500 in sales and another 600 overnight um after midnight alhamdulillah wow how much profit did you make on the 2.5k in sales i haven't worked it out yet but probably probably around 50 percent after deducting ad costs and product cost okay so she's in a position where she's made over a thousand um dollars or pounds um in a day in a day right <laughs> so uh she's made she made two and a half k three k in sales uh, at 50% she's made about 1.5k in profit in one day selling products uh, just by her laptop and this was her first month of launching okay not saying that that's going to be everyone's results okay normally when we work with clients we aim to get them to at least a thousand dollars in sales within the first month because we want to take it slowly we want them to learn the process so here's for example here's another uh, whatsapp snap result from client who started this month he's hit the thousand uh this was Danish's sales last month so a client within his you know hit tooth k within within his first month right but the point being is the first month is just about you understanding how to make money how to select the right products and getting some results and that builds you confidence so that you can make your first 10k within three months and then after three months your results should be somewhere between 10k to 100k a month at 20 to 40 percent profit margin okay so that's what we need to do so for us to achieve that we need to find products okay i'm going to show you how to do that now using a website called aliexpress where suppliers put their products on for us to be able to sell okay now there is three core criteria that i'm going to be analyzing here all right the product should be attention grabbing so that when you see it you're like wow that's unique that's amazing i would love that okay so the reason why is because we're going to be using social media ads like facebook ads to to drive traffic to our store in other words market our website bring people onto our website okay so the the product needs to grab some level of attention okay the second thing is it should have high perceived value the product should look expensive feel expensive and not something cheap that you can find in any any little store that you go to okay and the third factor is it should be able to be a minimum of 30 dollars margin um minimum so that we can profitably buy customers using social media ads all right so should we jump into aliexpress all right so <clears throat> the example that i'm going to give here uh just off the bat is watches okay so let's just see if i put in watch okay so what you do is you, you look at a product all right um and then what i like to do you can click orders sometimes and you can see um hold on orders based on orders da, da, da. okay so it's a bit buggy at the moment uh, so it's not showing normally it shows the ones that are really high in orders um but it's not necessarily showing that right now it's showing ones with slightly less orders which is fine okay so point being is what i would do is i was put uh, let's say we put in a uh, the word watch okay now what i would do is i would start scrolling through things and start seeing if anything grabs my attention okay this one here kind of grabbed my attention now i'm kind of ignoring these ones like these technology ones because and ones that look like apple watches because i know personally they've been done and dusted with right um so what i'm what i'm doing now i'm starting to go down the rabbit hole to look at okay is there anything that if this was on social media and i was actually interested in looking for a watch would it grab my attention for me to feel okay that's a fairly nice watch okay oh that's a cool watch and what i'm looking for 
is something a little bit unique and a little bit different okay so i want to be in a position where i'm like you know what uh that's nice that's different that's unique um that's the kind of field that i want to get into right so i'll just start sitting here browsing you know the third you know a good 10 pages down to see what if there's anything that that kind of interests me okay now mm -mm, okay so there's a few that i just picked out okay so this one here kind of grabbed out to me because it's it's like a uh, very gold very eye-catchy okay i think it does grab attention all right so does it attention grabbing to some level yes it's just the bright colors you've got contrast it pops out right is that high perceived value it looks pretty expensive so let's say it's like 50 pounds for this this product i would sell it at around 100 pounds okay so i would double it anything above 30 dollars i would double it can it be sold for over 30 dollars probably yes um so although it's attention grabbing and so forth i probably wouldn't sell this because it, it's kind of ugly in my opinion right like i wouldn't wear this yeah so although it, it meets the criteria it doesn't necessarily connect with me and i can't really think of an audience that it really would connect with okay this one is a little bit better looking it's eye-catchy um it's it's not too bad okay it's not 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 a bad product so i would i would potentially consider testing this one okay this one here is is a bit of a unique factor because it's like it looks very professional but then in the middle it's got like a um the face of a joker for example right uh, but not everyone would really like that right so i like to normally look for products that the vast majority of the people would like unless it's a very clear niche in which i'm selling for right now this one again it's eye catching it looks a bit like a fidget spinner um uh it, it it definitely grabs attention but again in my opinion it's it's pretty ugly right it's a pretty ugly watch uh and the the average person on the street wouldn't really wear this in my personal opinion all right now here's another trick that you can do okay just say you found a product like this and it's a bit like you know what this is interesting but maybe not what you can do is you can start analyzing this company okay so uh watch store china right so if i if i go to top selling now i can look at what their top sellers are okay now in here it says orders i try to not sell anything above 500 okay because it's more saturated um so let me see if there's anything here that kind of grabs my attention this looked pretty crazy and in my opinion like when i look at watches if there's a, a big color contrast uh, that that normally also helps okay so this one is is pretty it, <clears throat> it's it's similar to the joker one but that one's more like a smart watch with a joker in it and it just doesn't really look that cool this one has a bit of a <clears throat> an, a, a kind of childish um uh what's it called a, a chrome type of feel to it so a younger audience could could uh buy this and i would sell it for around 60 pounds for example if this is 30 um the images are not very good though like the, the images are, are not that great um so it's not something that super excites me again this store just you know it's a bit ugly watch right this you know this one here this you know so you've got you've got a few different designs right so i'm just trying to teach you the process this one is okay we've already done that one okay all right let's again look at this store you can look at top selling i can browse through this is there anything that really catches my eye and that makes me go wow okay you've got new arrivals okay i can you know whatever right so let's let's have a look at this product here okay does this grab attention yeah it's it's cute okay um is it high perceived value no it's like four pounds i i i, don't, I think i would struggle to sell that for 40 dollars right so that would be a hard no for me yeah um another thing is when you're on a listing if you scroll down and this is another way to find some really good products okay uh, 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 uh um where is it 
here okay so you got seller recommendations all right uh, and here you will find some other other watches that might 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 work out pretty well for you okay so let's let's have a look at some of these just for the sake of it all right so this one it, it's kind of like an apple watch but it's not techno technical and tech it's digital i'm trying to say so that's not, not that's, it's pretty eye-catching it's pretty cool um you've got different color variants so you can actually sell bundles so that is that has some potential there the orders are less okay so that's pretty cool this one it grabs attention but it's a bit ugly but maybe an older an older audience could potentially be interested in that watch this one's pretty cool it grabs attention it looks pretty smart i i see that you know somebody might like this it's you know an older kind of guy uh, it's got nice brown it's got a it's got a cool cool tone to it the images are pretty good quality um this is being sold for how much uh, 30 pounds so i would sell around 60 okay this one's a bit same old same old bit boring probably same with this it's kind of different it's okay so yeah that's not too bad of a watch and the, the, the uh, you know the other thing is oh, this one's pretty unique this one's pretty eye catchy it's it's different um the only issue is it's 145 pounds it's very expensive if i was to sell it i would probably sell it for around 300 pounds um but as starting off i would sell i would say sell your products between 30 to 100 dollars so i wouldn't really go for that uh this one again it's it's kind of same old same old right so that's how I kind of browse through a product. Okay, uh, I I would put in a keyword. I would go through the. I would go through. I would go through the pages. Let's say one to ten. Okay, and then what I would do, I'll try to uncover products, and then from there I would look at um, what other products the this the specific seller is selling by looking at top sellers, and you find things in here that is not really findable within the search okay um and at the same time uh if you go to a listing and you scroll all the way to the bottom it says seller recommendations and you find some really good gems here right you find some good gems here all right now uh what the best thing is okay so we've got watch right what 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 we want to do is we want to kind of the best way to do this Okay, and really to be ahead of the game is to be able to uncover products that are going to be hard to find in search terms, right? Uh, but they need to be unique and ideally connect with a clear audience, okay? Um, so I'll give you an example of a million dollar watch. This one has, has sold a lot, okay? Uh, and you'll see why. Okay, so this one here, okay? So <clears throat> I've sold a, a ton of these, yeah, loads, right? I'm pretty sure... If, if you was to sell this product, you'd find a, a kind of newer version. Um, you would also, you will also be able to sell a lot of these. Okay. I've, so, I've sold a lot of, I was one of the first sellers of this one. Uh, 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 all right. So let me, let me, let me explain this product to you. Okay. So what, uh, shush. So, okay. So the, anyway, video played. All right. So the unique, the unique aspect of this is it's a watch that, uh has a, a, a if you can see a car alloy so like a brake pads and it looks like a car uh, alloy okay rim whatever you want to call it right so anybody who's a guy who has oh shush yeah anyone who's a guy who likes cars would think if they've seen that for the first time they'll be like wow that's a really really cool concept right so this is about four, 35 pounds I, I think i used to sell it between 80 pounds to 100 um and and what you can do is is find newer versions of this um and try to sell different versions that may be coming out okay so let's let's have a let's see this one's nice i, I haven't actually sold this one this one's fairly new 10 orders it's a blue with a black a black metallic look to it uh it looks nice images are nice 
all right so that's a potential of, of a watch that you could sell for 80 pounds absolutely crush it with right slightly different design here okay so these have done very well all right now <clears throat> then you know when do you start diving into watches i personally if i'm like i'm going to chill out a few watches go on tiktok and search watches uh, go on youtube go on um amazon ebay okay go on google all right like find out what 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 watches are selling what is unique all right and you'll come up with more unique aspects so have a look at this one all right so this watch this watch here is similar like a car watch but it's wooden can you see that right so it's got another unique element to this okay um i've sold a ton of wood watches okay loads all right um why are they not coming up all right so let me let me show you some examples so these are some examples of wood watches okay uh i've sold this let me see uh wood watches also again it's <clears throat> so in the first one you can kind of see like you don't you know you can kind of see uh the first one which was the car they has an interest in 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 cars okay um in terms of like wood watches, who would you target? You would target people that are more interested in kind of nature, nature type of products and, and stuff like that, right? So they're more outgoing. So you can kind of see the difference here in terms of, of the type of audiences that you'll be connecting with, right? Um, all right, let me just see. If there's anything else that kind of... All right, so let me just let me just see. Okay, so that was okay. So this, I I remember selling selling quite a few of this one. Bobo Bird's a pretty good company. Um, so if you go to top sellers, they will show you some other products that sold well. Um, I think I sold this a lot of this one. Uh, let's see was it this one all right so what 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 also team seems to sell well for me is when there's like a clash of, of colors like this yeah so like a light blue uh and a kind of contrast it's eye-catching the images are pretty decent like this is a very nice image i could use it's a bit dull so i would possibly brighten it up a little bit but you can see this is high perceived value right again 70 pounds you can probably sell this one for okay um there again a bit of a contrast nice quality images uh here's another one i think i've sold quite a few of these ones as well okay all right I, i'm pretty sure i sold this one but i think this is a new slightly updated design so i think this would sell really well it's super cheap 15 16 pounds you could easily sell that for 50 pounds all right um so you get an example there right in fact let's 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 move away from watches um and let's look at some brace Men, let's look at men's bracelets okay so <clears throat> bracelets do pretty well um uh, so again what you want to do is you want to look for something unique okay unique and and different that makes you go wow that's cool all right so uh, uh, i'll give you i'll give you a bit of an example here okay um so <clears throat> this one here is like a it's a it's a very trendy type of bracelet because it's like it's made out of this it look like you know the 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 chain on a bike okay so these images are pretty pretty bad but it looks like a very a street kid would like this type of product okay so they would <clears throat> they'll be interested in this type of product you know you can sell it for 39.99 or something for example right add your 30 30 dollar margin or, or 29.99 or whatever it is with shipping okay this one's a bit better or not better but you can see different examples of this um so this this is something that, again, you know, when you're looking at products, you you need to think who would be interested in in this type of product, okay? Um, 
so you know and then you know if you were in that audience would you like it right another bracelet i've sold a ton of these types of bracelets okay uh we called them viking bracelets viking uh, again an audience that had interested in Vi in vikings um we sold this is the one that we sold a ton of a lot i'll show you it So, uh, um, just get rid of some of these tabs. All right. So, <clears throat> uh, so can you see here? This is a really eye-catchy type of product because the the bracelet is like a dragon, right? So, if somebody is kind of into Vikings, a bit gothic, um they'll be like oh yeah you know that looks good right maybe not this one it's got some weird horns to it oh no it doesn't i think this is the one this is the one actually i sold a lot of i'm pretty sure if this is this one it was similar to this <clears throat> but yeah especially this like type of foil that makes it look really heavy and metallic um again it's it's just something that's that's just unique right so you know and and i can see an audience for it do you see my point right Men's uh, bracelet. So what I would do is I would again just search around. All right, you know what? Let me look at some bracelets. Let me let me you know dive in here. Let me see what I can find. Let me go down the rabbit hole and start uncovering products that that you know I could start selling that meet my criteria that I get excited about. That I'm like, wow, you know what? This is a good product. Okay. This one here, for example, sold millions, okay, millions of products. Is I'm pretty sure it's overly saturated now. But can you just see, it looks premium, you know, uh, it looks nice, all right? Looks nice, looks very expensive, okay? But can you see the orders? 2,768, okay? It's it's over 500, so that's how you know there's no point doing it. It's, it's too saturated, you know, and, and move on essentially all right so essentially just to summarize what what the way this works is you need to sit down and spend a couple of hours selecting different types of products and i would say to you do you know what come uh and analyze watches and bracelets think of other audiences that you may think of to say you know what maybe there's a product in here like i don't know uh islamic right put in random words with the word bracelet and see what comes up literally i just this came out of the blue in my mind okay and then i'll start going through this i'll start seeing okay is there anything that is actually good here <laughs> right not really so far but you know you can go down the rabbit hole and you will find some gems okay there's 99 percent of what you're going to see is not good but that one percent if you get 10 of those one percent 10 different products that attention grabbing that they look premium you can sell them for a much bigger margin and they're like they excite you you would use them or you know an audience or somebody that would use them then uh and the image quality in the listings good uh, and the finance makes sense then you make a list of 10 products and you launch all 10 in one go okay and that's exactly what these people did they launched a bunch of products they saw which one worked that didn't work and then they just started scaling them so that they are able to get uh, amazing results and amazing income just from their laptop okay so the whole point is just to summarize we need to get you in a position where you launched your business you're adding you're launching products and you're making money now if you want hand holding in doing that then go into the description under this video there's a link for extra training i'm going to give you more deeper training on the the bigger picture of, of the website and everything like that how that all works and then if you want my hand holding in my team's hand holding in in getting this launched and launching some products with you just like alhamdulillah so many of our students have got some amazing results then you know you can you can book a call with us and we can we can see where you are and, and talk to you from there right but point being is 
go ahead go into the description click the link and go ahead and watch that extra training if you want to start fast tracking yourself and, and launching your next 10 products okay now what i want you to do is obviously um subscribe to this channel because i'm going to be launching more videos where i'm going to showcase more products in different niches so today was about you know watches and stuff uh home decor is a good audience and stuff like that so i want to do more videos in different audiences so you learn better better the type of products that you can sell um second thing is uh click the like if you found this valuable and just write a comment section what you liked about this video any questions any feedback um you know that would be awesome uh, you know if you see my videos I'm, I'm replying to everyone i possibly can which i think is literally everyone um so do comment below it would be really nice to touch base with you also uh, under the description um you've got my snapchat my instagram my facebook feel free to to, to message me if you want um uh, on top of that i am uh da, 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 what was i gonna say yeah uh, uh on top of that if you do find this valuable for anyone else do share it with them um and benefit other people as well all right so go ahead click the link below subscribe like share do what you need to do support me in that way i'd really appreciate it and i will look forward to speaking to you in the next video assalamu alaikum